164 people flew out to Guam on Tuesday on Taiwan's first vaccine tourism flight. The passengers were looking to take advantage of Guam's vaccination and vacation program, which offers quarantine-free stays to people with a proof of a negative COVID test taken within 72 hours of departure. Once they arrive in Guam, travelers can pay out of pocket for their choices of three vaccines, Pfizer, BioNTech, Moderna or Johnson & Johnson. This is not a drill. People are actually going to Guam. The island offers fantastic diving, plenty of sunshine and COVID vaccines. I want to go diving and also get vaccinated. I want the Moderna vaccine. I'll see whether I can get the second shot after coming back to Taiwan. If I can't, then I'll just go abroad again. My family's home is in Luzhou in Greater Taipei. I want to get a vaccine to be better protected. Only then would I dare go home. I haven't been over there in more than two months. To attract vaccine tourists, Guam has waived quarantine requirements for travelers with a negative PCR test taken within 72 hours of departure. Once there, they can get a COVID vaccine of their choice, Johnson & Johnson, Moderna or Pfizer, before immediately getting on with their tropical getaway. The tour operator said it thought Johnson & Johnson would be the top choice among travelers, but only 23 percent picked the one-dose vaccine. Some 34 percent of travelers chose Pfizer, and 38 percent picked Moderna which is also rolling out in Taiwan. Their choices reflect how confident they feel in the vaccines. They may come back to Taiwan and follow the CECC's priority arrangements to get their second shot. I'm staying for longer, maybe a whole month. I'm getting Pfizer. It requires a wait of 21 days between the first shot and the second, so I can get the second shot too. The tour agency had initially offered only five-day packages, but seeing heated demand for longer stays, it launched trips of up to 22 days too. 80% of all slots are already sold. The 22-day itinerary costs only about half of what it would cost for foreign nationals to get vaccinated on the continental United States. In the U.S., anyone over 12 years of age can get the Pfizer vaccine. The policy has prompted entire families to fly from Taiwan to get inoculated in hopes of attaining protection and peace of mind.